Hello and welcome back to Haster Plays Spelunky 2. This is the uh, first game of the night for me, so uh, hopefully it'll go pretty well. No warm up, but uh, we should, you know, we should do fine. All right, so. What are we looking for? We are looking for a win with the tab. Okay. Oh, <laughs> we're looking for a win with the tablet. But even uh, first, we will just be happy with getting the tablet. Yes. So we still have uh, a few things to unlock in the journal. Um, we have not made it to Duat yet, and that would be nice. We have made it to the Golden City, but on that run, which I'm trying to remember if I have a video up with that or not. Hmm. I know I recorded it. I don't know if I've uploaded it though. Um, that was kind of early in my, my testings. Um, so yeah, made it to the golden city, but had already gotten killed so we lost the ankh unfortunately so we couldn't do the uh, sacrifice kind of want to hit this guy with the pot ha huh. all right yeah so as far as unlocks go in the journal we need that um let's take a quick peek yeah so yeah, there's Duat. And then, yeah, then we have the end game stuff, which. Why is it through one, two, three, four? Huh. I could think of two things, not four things. Um, and then we have two playable characters yet to unlock and yeah so you know there's all the, the guys a few traps that's gonna happen in world seven i think item wise yeah there's definitely a few things i can think of that i don't have i can't think of all seven but yeah we're uh we're close, 80%. Pretty good. Alright, shop's pretty good. I mean, it's basic, but... It's all very useful stuff. Wouldn't mind, uh... Oh, was that a triple? I think that was a triple kill. Very cool. Um, Wouldn't mind some shoes. Spike boots. Best boots. Um, your mont over here, yeah. Hmm. What's happening over here? Interesting. Come on, spider. Turkey. Oh, we're real good on time. Uh, one turkey. Did I miss the other turkey? And or skip it. Huh. I don't see it. My general rule is I don't be uh I don't bomb for one turkey. But maybe we'll uh bring him along. Oh there it is. Ah, you know what? 
us. We don't ever take them to Yang anymore. It's I said before, we've got no good luck. But we'll try. It. We got the time. We got the turkeys. Oh. Ah, look at that. I could have got the uh the torch. Hmm. Well, I could use it to the torch to kill him. See, see what I mean? We're getting this little gems. I mean, it's. I guess it added up. Hmm. That's fine. Is there a rock or anything? Take a skull. Just in case. Oh. Oh, we're going to, uh. Watch the. Whoa. Come on. Lizards. These lizards, I tell you. All right, so there's the key. Yeah, we see the room. I didn't see the room yet. Ah, uh, there it is. Uh, oh no, it's not. Okay, so it's gonna be down even further. <sighs> Sucks when that, when the altar is Nice and high up, but there's no Monty in sight. Oh. Side of the room. Oh, it's cut off too, huh? Yeah. Alright. Let's hurry up then. Uh. Get back up. No, we can't. Let's bomb. Shoot. I don't think I can bomb here and get it. Was it one, two? Yeah, I don't think that'll do it. It's alright. Excuse. Excuse to get money. And I, I wouldn't mind hitting that crate. Ghost will spawn over here, but I think I can still get out. Oh, here he comes. Alright, no problem. Alright, good money. Decent stats. Money crate. Another crate over here. Jeez. Okay. Tell it. Uh, I'm not. I don't want to get tempted by the teleporter. Definitely not a. Uh, 
practiced enough with it to feel like I won't kill myself <laughs> pretty quickly. Um, it is cool. I kind of wanted that other crate, but... Oh, still got the flame. Nice. I didn't think that would hit it. Alright, so let's talk. Huh? Let's talk logistics here, which... Game plan. Minute and a half. Oh, never mind. We got we got the cash. We got the black market money. Ooh, we got the ghost pot too. We could try to get weird, but I don't think I want to. What I mean by that is uh Oh, I kinda wanted to kill him. I didn't really have an easy way to do it. Already running low on time. Um, getting weird, meaning going to uh, the uh, Gist shopkeeper. And if you say, what is that? I can at least show you who that is. Right there. In the darkest corners, they peddle their wares, hoping to preserve some small shred of their former life. Yeah, so... Now, I did not discover that on my own, I will freely admit. I uh, saw someone else do it on stream, and uh, it's pretty cool. I mean... I could show it in a video, but you know, I'm sure there's already a bunch out there. Basically you, it's shop, it's near the end of 1-4 uh, there. Basically if you take the, uh, the shortcut, like from the, uh, the camp, let's get this boomerang real quick. Um, yeah, if you take the shortcut, the door you come out of there, it's, it's, it's just a little bit above that door, uh, hidden in the uh, dirt. Ooh, that's cool. I never saw that layout before. Um, and it's a shop door, or basically it's a door, you know, like into the, the, the subspace or the backspace, whatever you want to call it, like the cave innards and um it uh you can't go through the door though the door looks like the face of a ghost and uh you can only get through if you're cursed so you, you can do some shenanigans where you curse yourself uh with the ghost pot and uh, Kinda, kinda weak on money. Where? Sorry to trail off, but no idol. Huh. Anyway, yeah. Get to the end. Use bombs to uh, dig a hole to the door, and then if there's a ghost pot, you can. Curse yourself via. Um, now, there's are numerous ways you can also look that up. Um, but you know, you can use the uh, those thumper traps. Oh, to knock you into the pot. You can set it up on like a, net, a ledge and bomb. All right, don't get crushed. By the heavy blocks. It's my it's my moon challenge mantra because I do it more often than I'd like to admit. Um, yeah. So curse yourself, and then uh, yeah. Yeah, let's just let's bust it. I always 
I always worry about the arrow though. Oh, a scorpion? Great. Alright, don't need the bow. Get cursed, go into the shop, and you'll see a deceased caveman. Oh, this is a little bit too high up. They'll be the guest shopkeeper. Not that that matters. He's basically just a ghost. And, um. Alright. Don't get crushed. Oh, see? I almost got crushed right there. Holy crap. Alright, now let's get some rubies. Oops. This is the most long-winded tale because it's hard to talk and play sometimes. Um, the cool thing is, it doesn't sell you anything, he just has presents. But they're not the regular old... Oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> I'm not a servant of Hunden. I just accidentally whipped you to death. Alright, alright. Telling tales, dying. Um, yeah, he's got presents, and these presents can actually have really good. Well, I guess good subjective, but uh, rare items. So you can get the Kapala like right away. You could get. Uh, Plasma cannon. Uh, all kinds of stuff. Right at 1 4, which is pretty cool. Obviously, risky because you are cursing yourself and whatnot. But, I mean, it is. Eh, eh, might as well see what's over here. Nothing. But you can get uncursed. It's kind of like, you know, high risk reward gameplay if you want to try to go for some killer items. But have to take the chance that you can actually get enough altars to uncurse yourself. So, yeah, if you had already seen an altar to some sacrifices, perhaps, um, maybe it's worth it. Alright, get my shoes. Don't really care for anything else. Alright. I'll be looking for a key. Let's see it yet. Yeah, no signs of that yet. Um, fall on the spikes. So Alright, so exit. Alright, let's just double check that there wasn't an altar back here. Alright, no altar. And seemingly no key. But we got the ghost pot, got the turkeys. Alright, so we drop money down. We're gonna drop a turkey down. Now we're gonna ride a turkey down. 
with the pot. And not like that. Okay. Ah. Yeah, no, I'm like going yang crazy here, but crate? Alright, I'll crate. Bombs? Huh? Not gonna be mad at bombs. Malls. All right, cool. Decent health. Okay, supplies. Yeah, you know I'm throwing this cave in on them spikes. Oh, spike shoes, never mind. Don't have to. Got them on my feet. Alright. So far, so good with this stuff. Alright, see the key. See the. Gambling. Alright. Alright, there's the right, there's the spot. Where oh man, I'm like, where's my compass? That was last run. Lost it. <laughs> what? And I hit that. <laughs> Go on, I'm getting some great shots here. You must admit, I'm getting some wild shots. Alright, we got a little time just to see what the next item is. Assuming I can win this real quick. It's so stressful throwing these things, gotta be honest. Alright, parachute. Oh, come on. Jetpack could be a game game changer. Come on, six. There it is, folks. Camera, no thanks. All right. So this is when you tell yourself, don't screw this up. Take it easy. Got some nice gear. Got nice money you don't gotta even worry about. You didn't anger the shopkeepers in any way. Bowl. Oh. You're the worst. But I missed money. 10 seconds, doesn't matter. All right. All right, cool. Totally, totally live with this. Ooh, Mont, you're in a bad sitch. In a bad situation, my friend. Um, And it is a pain in the butt to get Monty out of here. Although I, has, I got spike shoes. So, oh. Uh, Almost threw this right at the spider. Could have broke the pot. Um. Yeah, all right. We can uh, we can kill the dude pretty fast. So. Oh. Oh my gosh. Ha! Picking him up on the platforms is like super hard sometimes. Monty, I, I apologize. <laughs> I apologize for that, friend. You... You're always there for me. And I whipped you to death by accident. Don't stop me. Come on. Alright. We 
got money. We got boots. We're definitely going. Jungle. Come on, give me this. I would have liked that ruby, but I also don't want to waste too much time. So, come on. Whoa. That spider for me. go get our monies all right we got a we got, we got a lizard waiting for us the other side of that door don't like it but we get a little bit of invincibility as we go through perfect Um, yeah, bring it. <laughs> All right, so we got shoes. Ooh, oh, we also got paste. If we can hit this bomb, actually, you should probably die no matter what. Oh, I don't know about throwing this bomb. Oh, nice. All right, great. Great. Okay, so let's take your time. Get the things. Let's check out over here real quick. All right, we should be fine. I don't want to catch the edge. That's the problem. So, oh gosh, come on. All right, see, that was sketchy. Oh, there's another spider. Check that out. Oh, now he's now he's live. He's involved. Haha. <laughs> Can he jump low? Alright, we took a hit. Not cool, but Oh god. Oh my goodness. Alright guys, thanks. That was a uh That was something. That was <laughs> See those are those situations you gotta be like, well how do I wanna do this? You know? And Ugh. I mean, that was, I mean, all I had to do was drop down. I shouldn't have got stuck, but I did. Ah, oh, man. Disappointing. All right, you know what? All right, let's, I was like, you know, I'll cut this up here, but let's see. I, I already, I'm going to be honest. I already don't like this layout, but. You know, we're, we're doing, we're doing some no, no warm up play here. So I already felt like that run was already going like way better than the last. I was feeling good. Oh, jeez. What though? I'm gonna miss. I'm gonna miss the spike shoes. Get out of here. Oh, I don't want to. Well, whatever. Let's see. Let's see where he goes. I knew it. I kn that yeah 
Yeah, I was gonna say, it's these situations I would like to see a little bit further, just so I knew where the, um... Uh... Oh, oh, the skull. The skull, wait, why did it kill him? I thought he had four hit points. Two from the dart. Hmm. I would have thought two from the dart and one from the skull. Yeah, I just don't even want to have that be an option. The money over here. Okay, let's go see what we got in the shop. Uh, oh, we take the bombs. I, I don't. I don't think any of that warranted theft. I mean, it's like it's almost. Did it make sense to? You know, it's like you're gonna rob them, you'll get the shotgun for free, so why? I don't even really know what I'm doing in here right now, to be honest. Let me get money. Um, uh, yeah. Let's. Let's see. Is he gonna get stuck? No, he should should be okay. This is tricky for me because the bat. But oh, oh, jeez. Like I heard him get whacked. But okay, so that's down. No, oh. wait, that wasn't the. I didn't just miss the, the door, did I? Crap. Alright. Oh no. This should be it. Okay. on that. Alright, cool. Altar. Can't just, can we just put money like right next to it? Give me a little, a little freebie. I don't even hear him. Alright, hired help. Alright, we can get back up. That's gonna be, what? Two ropes. I think it's up this path. You know, let's clear these out just in case. All right, well, since. Oh, yeah. Well, this is. Oh, well, there we go. Now it's. Now it's not. How much for him, just so I know? Okay, we have enough. Um. We have a new channel here, obviously, so we're just getting started. A lot of my viewers right now are friends, but not a lot of them, perhaps, know the ins and outs of Spelunky. Uh, so maybe I talk about some of the specifics of what I'm trying to do here. Wait, I just hear Monty. Yeah, there he is. Okay. All right, we got some time. We need a turkey to throw down this pit. Thank you, sir. Um, the first thing we tried to do was get some money. So the shop will spawn on the second or third floor. So you always want to try to gear up best you can on the first floor. 
next on the second ooh, second or third floor you'll get the key to spawn which will also have that room spawn and you'll jump like that oh Bonnie no oh my gosh oh man I was gonna sacrifice that um well you know what I know at this point maybe I should just bomb the turkeys well yeah we look for that room to unlock the Ujit eye which you can see up there now it's an item I have it's actually next to my uh, money right to the left there and that's giving me an ability to see like these gems in the ground and hidden items and things like that and there's also another item uh, that does that uh, the uh, I kind of still want to sack that guy but anyway um, the glasses also do that um, and they also they provide a different ability but the reason you main reason you get the Ujidai dice is because it allows you to go to a secret area on the next level the next world um, so if you go to the jungle which is what I've been doing uh, on the second third or fourth floor the, the black market will spawn um, the entrance to the black market is hidden but the Ujidai will make noise uh, when you're close to a approaching it uh, I hate this by the way lizards once they start rolling they'll combo you um, so you, you can find the black market without the eye either by chance um, or you know just you're going into the caves anyway to do other stuff nice the skeleton key dropped um, but if you go the other way to volcano you use it to power a drill that goes down to uh, allows access to Dracula's castle actually you know what we're gonna go that way oh if I could kill him that would be grand um although I think it's gonna take a while because I'm gonna have to beat him with skulls and stuff yeah I just don't feel like doing that um and we have we have okay health right now oh we did get a rock let's see maybe we can hit him with the rock a bunch because I mean never have too much health and you definitely can't have too many bombs we have okay amount of time oh I missed it's gonna get harder to dodge him. All right, we're gonna have to. Oh, all right, he's down there. All right, forget it. But oh, got a little more money. Yeah. So if you go volcano, the Ujidai powers this drill that d digs down, and. Um, you get to Dracula's castle Dracula's castle lets you get some cool items oh, I was gonna go back up for money but uh, yeah you can get a special cape there back this is great because we have the uh, skeleton key ah now we just made this cost us a rope but I was gonna say I don't really care, but I kind of do because I only had the one. Anyway, ah, right, that kind of sucks. I shoot it here. Yeah. Well, anyway. Um. So what are we doing here? Here, we're doing an optional thing of 
freeing Van Horn. What do they call him? Van, I call him Van Helsing. It's like Van Horsing or something like that. Um, he, uh, if you free him here and then go to Dracula's castle, he will be there and he can help you out. Um, by killing uh, Vlad for you. Yeah, I, I don't really like these shoes, to be honest. But they're going to be helpful here. Well, I really don't care about that, but I could win it. Yeah, okay. Win it real quick. Yes. Okay. All right, even though we're our goal to go to the castle and get us a better cape. In the meantime, this is amazing. So, just gamble a little more. Making some money in the meantime. Come on. So you try to do this quick, but you try not to hit yourself with the dice and get hurt. Or throw the dice out of the room and have the guy go ape on you. All right, so they only do three. Oh, I see Monty just died. Um, yes, yeah, so I think we're cool over here. Oh, now we're real cool. All right, so big jumps. Oh, oh no! Oh, that just flew like we had the pitcher's mitt. Um, do we want to get lots of money? Let's see if one bomb will expose the, uh, ah, uh, no. Well, we got the time. Let's get the uh, pot of gold. So we, uh, a leprechaun died. Uh, which exposed the uh, pot of gold. This is nice. I think you pick up around 12,000. All right, cool. So that was a good floor. We, we got Van Horsing. So when we go to Dracula's castle, hopefully we can get to Dracula's castle. But when we go there, um, he'll make fighting Vlad easy. Although that's, that's really not even that that hard um oh, telepack um well it's not that hard if you have a weapon if you have a shotgun you can blast him um he does teleport around like actually teleport and you can do a uh, telefragging oh there's another another leprechaun i wouldn't mind killing him i don't want I don't want that to blow up and send that lava everywhere. There we go. See, let's get him out of there. Where'd I toss him? Down there? Okay. Alright. Let's beat him up a little bit. Click one more hit those ropes there we go okay cool um oh, so i don't think i said what the uh shamrock does it uh lets you have five minutes on a level rather than the three before the ghost comes so it's nice you get some more time oh there's another pot of gold Eh. I have the climbing. I do have the climbing gloves. I think I could make that jump. Yeah, I think so. But let's get. Oh, the key! Crap. All right. Let's see if we can get back and get that key. Ah! Jumped around like an idiot here. <laughs> there we go. Oh, now you're gonna take the key. 
Oh, what am I talking about? I got the skeleton key. You idiot. Alright, so there's the way out. I didn't search over there. He doesn't care if you go in here. Ah, doesn't really have anything anyway. Ooh, hired help. Ah, I really don't want the hired help. Um, I will buy Monty. And... Yeah. Took the key. All right, sorry. Dogs were walking around. Kind of creeped me out. Um, yeah, this guy's going to be a real pain in the butt. They always are. Um, oh, I don't want to hit him. I want to pick him up. And have him go in the lava. Okay, there you are. If you... Oh. Oh, yeah. We... We want those spike shoes. Can we get back up? Eh. Oh, you know what? We can just power the drill. And then go to the shop. Yeah, we want the shoes. Alright, so this... This actually consumes the Ujidai. As you see, it's like there, and I don't have it anymore. Um, yes. Like shoes. Nice. Alright, you know what's not nice though? That lava. That lava sucks. Um, shoot. Now we can, we can like blow that one up there. Crap. What if we can get a little lower? Go around. Nope. Okay. Go the other way. Alright, so I don't think that one's dripping anymore. Alright, we do have to hurry up. Um, we will get another shamrock. Oh, sorry, Monty. Alright, let's just go quick, quick. Okay, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Put you here. Kill you. Go inside. Whew. Okay, cool. So now we got the extra time. So why did I get rid of that hired help? I mean... They mean... <laughs> they mean well. Um... And they will help. They are helpful. I may not even get one here. I usually get one here to help with uh, other vampires besides. Ah, I missed it. Um, all right, just just in case, because you know it's it's easy to forget that you didn't trigger that. Um, besides Vlad, Vlad's right up there. You'll see. Um, Let's just go take care of that. Oh, there's another vampire. Yeah, like they're good for that. Let's see, boom. All right, to honor Mouth and his ways, I will give Ben Hornstein back his bolt. All right, and we'll switch over to this. And we got a scorpion, so we will leave. <laughs> we'll leave that area quickly. Um. Yeah, so why did we come here? We got the cape, but we got the crown. Um, so the two paths of the game, the jungle or the volcano, uh, one of the goals is to get a crown. So here it's, I think it's just called a crown. Oh, I see a secret shop. Jetpack. How much? Discounted usually, right? 27. Ah, uh, I mean. Pause for a second. Hmm. Pros and cons. I mean, Vlad's cape is a special cape. Um, it gives you a double jump besides letting you coast. Uh, so with that and the climbing gloves, which we have, 
we're very mobile and there's no danger in having the cape having the jetpack you're susceptible to different kinds of traps that do fire damage or a you know a corpse getting hit by something else and flying at you those things can ignite your backpack they can hit your backpack and you you have like a i think you actually have like a second to take it off but i mean you, you're not going to do it because you're usually going to get stunned um and it's going to blow up and kill you but i mean the jetpack is like you fly you know it's limited time but it's more mobile uh, but in most cases, I don't know. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think what I'm more used to. I mean, I, I am actually pretty used to the cape and the jetpack at this point. Um. Okay, well, let's reassess where we're at here. So we are on two, three. All right, cool. So there's only one more level of volcano left. Then we go to Olmec. The Olmec fight. I mean, theoretically, so we don't have paste, right? Okay, so we don't have paste, so the jetpack would make killing Olmec a little easier than the cape. But they're both capable. Um, what else? I mean, honestly, a lot of things that would just kill us anyway would just kill us whether it was the jetpack or not. But yeah, we'll go to Olmec. Um, we'll probably go... I actually want to get a win, <laughs> so I'll probably go Tide Pool, and I'm a little more versed in Tide Pool. Uh, then Ice Cave, I mean, it, they're pretty even. I mean, Neo Babylon is really where the jetpack becomes a liability because there's a lot of like danger things happening there. Ah, oh, man, if I had the Kapala, okay, so the, the last thing that the cape does is it gives you uh, double blood. When you kill stuff and if you had the kapala you use a there's a nice combo there but i'm gonna go jetpack i don't know i saw it it's there i'm gonna go with it although the cape does look cool especially on uh, this character um all right so jump over here see so like the lava would have like touched me dead dead um yeah we don't even have that many bombs wish we had some more bombs um yeah so crown why do we need a crown um so either buy get the crown like i just did or you ah, of course it's a night level um or you can get uh an item called oh geez uh, the Hedget. So, either go to Dracula's Castle. And, uh, yeah, we'll do the challenge. And get the crown. Oh, yeah, I was going to look up what the actual name of it is. Um, oh, crown. Okay. Oh, here they are both. So, you either get the crown. Or you can go to the black market and buy the hedget. The hedget costs forty thousand. So it's kind of like you see where you're at in your run. If you've been doing well money wise. Um all right, we got money. Um you you might say, hey, okay, I'm gonna go black market, because then black market is a black market. You got tons of items. Um but you know, you need a lot of money if you're going for a hedget. Uh, whereas with Volcano, you can just go get the crown and it's free, but you don't have as much opportunity to gear up. So um, we were lucky with some shops. I'm actually was kind of stoked on that. Um, at this point, I'm just gonna try to Grab anything valuable. Just, just get out of this challenge because this is a pretty weak moon challenge. Just had gold. We can try to get money. There might be a uh, altar we come across. 
Um, so yeah, you get the crown. Why do you need the crown? So just like you have the option to go uh, to the tide pool, or sorry, the uh, the jungle, or the volcano to get a crown, you have the option to go to tide pool. Oh, this is this is insane right here. I'm sorry. I gotta. I might actually bop this guy. Hopefully he didn't let out any lava. Nice. Doesn't look like he did. Um. Oh, I hear. Oh, there's the exit. Okay. Cool. Um. The crown enables items in these other two areas. Oh my gosh! There wasn't. <laughs> there was an altar. Come on, man. I mean, not a big deal. We're, we're doing all right um, overall, but getting getting a little alter action would have been nice. Um, let's just get out of here. Um, yeah, so if you go to the tide pool and you have the crown of some kind, Hedget or the crown, you can get Excalibur. And then you can try to go to a secret area in the tide pool where you use Excalibur to uh, fight a special boss and then you get the tablet and the same you can also get a tablet via the other route which is the temple where you uh actually i should i, I should back up a step you also need this an, an item called the ankh and you can get that by defeating olmec which is what we're about to do right now um so if you have the ankh the ankh gives you another life if you die which is nice you come back with four health um now you can go tide pool and technically not use the ankh to then get to the tablet it's kind of intended that you do but there are ways around it if you have the right items um which technically i do but i've never done the ankh skip so i'm a little scared of doing it but i you know it's possible um the if you go the temple route you have to use the ankh and so that involves you killing anubis to get the scepter his scepter which is cool it's a cool weapon it's kind of dangerous but it's awesome and then on the next level you will find a doorway a golden door and if you have the crown and the scepter you can use it on the door to open it and leads you to the city of gold when you're on the city of gold let's get this olmec fight started um you can oh there's a big altar Kind of like the Kali altars um, there, and uh, you can sacrifice yourself on it. There's a little room that makes it just big enough for you to sacrifice. All right, no, no crates. Um, yeah, so you sacrifice yourself, and it takes you to. Duat, which is like another it's kind of cool you see your soul like fly over to it um and it's basically a secret area where you work your way up to the top to fight i think you're fighting anubis again it's just he's like a god in in duat rather than kind of like a floating mummy um all right so how are we gonna do this It's like we're gonna have to whip him. And I really don't wanna do this, do it like that, but we don't have paste, so. And they change this again, right? Yeah, yeah, so just, just being around here is gonna cause him to, to bomb. They've changed this fight a little bit. Um, in the last couple weeks, they've changed it like twice. Woo! Okay. Alright, so now I think he's done. It's done for now, yeah. Um So yeah, you go there and you can fight Anubis and you definitely Well I guess you not you don't need paste. It's paste is paste always makes these fights a little easier. Um 
Yeah, so we should plan out where we want him to drop. Um, and then you get the tablet that way. So there's two routes for getting the tablet. That was a really, it was, a, it was an in-depth description and a long-winded description, I apologize, um, for how you get the, uh, the tablet. I think I actually want him to do another, another bombing run. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. <laughs> You've hung with me long enough. This was a, a series of failures, and I think I might call the up that. Um, oh man. But yeah, we'll have to see. Uh, <laughs> we'll have to see how you get the tablet another time. Uh, yeah. Thanks for hanging with me, Aster. Signing off. See you next up. Thank you.